You'll achieve the most accurate readings if the device is held by the handle only, out in front of your body. As you scan an area, make sure that the device movements are slow and deliberate. This will help eliminate false readings. Before we step outside, let's practice some simple operations by locating a few common objects that may be found in your office. The floors, walls, and ceiling all contain objects that the inspector will locate. Point the device at the wall and pan slowly across it. You should pick up readings from stud locations. Make a note in your head of the angle from the instrument to the object. If you rotate the device to parallel with the stud, you'll see how the left and right indicator LEDs let you know when the transmitter is in alignment with the direction of the stud. This is exactly how it will react to pipes or other objects in the ground. It's very important to remember the left-right indicators alert the operator when parallel is achieved. You should take notice of the audible alarm as you move the device away and then back to the target. By rotating the device slowly and deliberately, you'll find exact alignment again. The simple use of an audible alarm and LEDs greatly enhance targeting capability. Quite simply, they will ultimately help identify the location and run direction of an object. By the way, you might want to lower the sensitivity of the device when locating shallow objects. The inspector is no different than any other technical device or tool. The more you use it, the better you get.